Odell, wasn't the whole thing about you not getting touches in in Cleveland? So that's why you, that's that's why you, that's why you wanted to be released. Okay, I get it. New England was a prime spot, so close to getting you. Because you wanted to be the wide receiver number one. And I get it with your talent. You were one of the most talented wide receivers we've seen in such a long time. So why sign with the Rams? Are you ring chasing? The Rams aren't even top their division. Cup. Woods. Higby. Jefferson. Henderson, there are so, so many people there who could be getting touches in place of you. In New England, Henry Aguilar, you will by far be the wide receiver number one in New England. Cooper Cup and Robert Woods, in my humble opinion, will be ahead of you in the depth chart in L.A., It just doesn't make sense. It was probably, um, it was probably mo money chasing or ring chasing. Okay, I get it. New England isn't going to deliver a ring this year. We think. I, ho I hope they will. I just don't get it. I don't get it. That's all I've heard, at least, that you that it was because you wanted to be the wide receiver one. Now, if it was for a completely different reason, okay. I don't, I don't know. Maybe it was your connection with, with Baker. I, I don't know. It just doesn't make sense to me why Odell would go to a place where he probably won't be the wide receiver one instead of places like... Maybe not Seattle, maybe not Green Bay. Oh. Um so no uh Seattle, Green Bay, and New England were the were the big three that were gonna be oh will he sign with them. New England, you would have been the wide receiver one. I just don't get it. In another NFL news, Cam Newton signs with the Panthers again. Okay, if Carolina, if you want to give him a chance, I get it. I think there are two spots that would have worked for Cam Newton in the NFL, and that would be Carolina and Washington. Wash well, Carolina because, you know, it's it's Carolina. Washington, because they're in need of a quarterback, or at least another quarterback that they know can produce something. And as a Patriots fan, you probably wouldn't... Uh, expect this, I still, to a degree, defend Cam Newton. I think he's still a very skilled quarterback. <sighs> Do I think he's nearly where he was in, like, 2015 to 2018? No. Not, not, e not even close. But I think his stat line last year did not show um, what type of a player he really was. But they signed him, they signed him back, and, uh, yeah. And Washington, I think, for two, well, Washington, as I said before, they're in need of quarterback, and it's Ron Rivera, who he worked with in Carolina. So, that's just my thought process. Anyway, I will see you guys next time. I'm sorry this was such a short video. Um, I was too lazy to edit, um, and... It was kind of just, um, right, right now I just got the idea, so, here, have an extra short, um, an extra short episode, a return episode of Talking About. So, yeah, there's that. I will see you guys next time. Happy Veterans Day, by the way. Ah. Uh, that's all I've got to say. Peace.